Okay, um, today I'm going to do something different. I am going to roll the camera the whole time on uh, my walk with Aslan at Brink Across Gardens. And <clears throat> sometime I'll give you the directions how to get here. You would not know. Um, you could easily miss this place like, like, like I just missed that, that entrance. Here's the sign. Brink Across Gardens. And um, there's a dog that lives next door here, and uh, he's been here most of the time. Uh, my favorite place to park is right here. <clears throat> the story of this place, and I don't know how many acres it is, like maybe 50 acres or something. Um, but, uh, if I'm off the road enough. Aslan. There we go. He's wondering, what the heck's going on? Okay, now, because Aslan has had uh, hip problems, I uh, gently c carry him down. Okay, so, okay, Aslan, you gotta come over here. I put my hat on. It's uh, about 19 degrees. Wait, Aslan. Wait, wait. I'm using a uh, iPod to do the recording. It's similar to this iPod. This is a Apple donates money with their red devices for um, um, fighting AIDS. <clears throat> well, anyway, the, there were two men who who owned this house, and um, they had it in their will that when they would die. Um, that the land would be donated to the county to make a park. And so the front part of this area, I, I've never been here in the summer, but it's supposed to be uh, quite beautiful. And, um, and then the back part is trails. And um, they're nice in that they're not... Um, like boring, just straight trails. They are um, curvy and, you know, it's, it's nice. So <clears throat> we're just gonna go. This is a, a typical route that I might go. And no one's here, so I'll um, take Aslan off the leash because he'll get more exercise that way. So when I go to these, I, I love walking. It, it's
it's a very good exercise for you and it stimulates your brain and makes you think. And um, so what do I? Here's what I mean about the curving. You can hear there's the Interstate 94, which runs. You know, from Chicago to Detroit, you could hear that in the background. And then um, there is uh, um, also a Route 20, um, which in part of the thing you can see it. Whenever, whenever I'm in a forest, <laughs> I think about the Bible and Jesus dying on a tree. And in um, the time of the Roman Empire, there were a lot of crucifixions and... Um, Many of them were done on just a tree without a cross beam. Um, they were just um, the person's hands were overlapped, put above their head, and that's where um, I'll call it a spike was used. <clears throat> and also then through their feet and I don't know imagine depending on depending on the person there had to be more to that <clears throat> so Aslan loves sniffing he His uh, grandparents' dogs were some type of champion dogs in um, competition where they sniff something and then they have to find it and find the clues. So I just let him do what he wants and uh, walk around and think. And Aslan is going to be 10 years old. In a couple months, on the first day of spring, it was when he was born, the 21st. What I love about snow is <coughs> it's an acoustic <coughs> dampener. It makes some um, things, uh, the sound are absorbed more. Oh, man. Well, I just got the disappointing news on this phone. <coughs> it says it's a... Uh, Battery's running low. It's got 20%. It was fully charged when I turned it on um, this morning and brought it with us. So the cold is getting to the battery. So lesson learned is that you need a little bit of a heat. Um, to keep uh, <coughs> the battery in better condition. But the battery red you know it was fully charged i mean i'm only recorded a whopping nine minutes here but at least anyway it's gonna go dead i'm sure <clears throat> but at least you'll see what this place is like <clears throat> brinka cross garden now a county park <clears throat> so anyway back to the snow i love the snow that it um Absorbs sounds, makes it quieter. Of course, especially when it's snowing, but even after, when there's lots of snow. Um, it's incredible, the dampening. So there's some spots here where there's been some water sort of flowing through here. 
So they try to put these things to prevent some erosion. These little um, bags that are filled with something like uh, dirt, sand. Good boy, Aslan. What a good boy. 